thank you. Thank you. Thanks a million. We bless your name. We give you praise and we give you glory. Everybody, let's worship him this morning. All over the world, let's give God praise this morning. In Ghana, in, in Lagos, in America, in United Kingdom, in all the Asia countries, let's bless God this morning. Wherever you are, let's bless the name of the Lord. You are in the northern part of Nigeria. You are in the southern part of Nigeria. You are in the eastern part of Nigeria. You are in the western part of Nigeria. Wave your hands and bless the name of the Lord this morning. Let's bless the rose of Sharon. Let's thank him because it's a new day. Let's thank him because it's a new season. Oh, la ke tu raba la tali kalabra gaduskia. Je krete li kalabra tali kasebra deshkaha. Sambolo to li katabalati zake ratu shatalaya. Somebody tell him thank you. Let's bless him this morning. It's a new day. God is a good God. This God is a good God. Lord, we thank you. Let's thank him for January. God did so much for us in January. Let's thank him for February. February was awesome. We give you praise this morning. Let's thank you for the month of March. March was awesome. We saw the finger of God in our land. We saw the hand of God upon families. Lord, thank you. Thank you for all you did for us in the month of March. Are you blessing this good God this morning? Are you praising him 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 this morning? Oh, la ke tu rada shataya. In April, we saw the wonders of God. We saw the awesomeness of Jehovah. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we thank you for the month of April. For all the favors. For all the directions. For all the provisions. For all the protections. We say thank you. Somebody thank you for the month of May. God came through for you in the month of May. It was a challenging month, but here you are standing. I want you to bless the name of the Lord. I want you to thank him for the month of May. Thank him for the month of May. The miracles he wrought in your life. Delivering you from that accident, from that sickness. Making provisions available. Helping your vision to move from glory to glory. Lord, we say thank you. Thank him for the month of June. June, we saw the mighty power of God. We saw visitation of the Almighty. We saw the, the, the angelic work in our lives. We give you praise. 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 Thank you, Father, for July. July, we were here. Oh, la kazata labaya. E krabata labashanda bada. The month of shalom, shalom. The month of perfect peace. We saw God in the month of perfect peace. The month of shalom, shalom. Which was the month of July. We saw perfect joy. We saw perfect health. We saw perfect provision. Lord, we say thank you. For all you did in August, the month of new season. We say thank you. Season of new things. We saw new things in our lives. Somebody praise him this morning. Honor him this morning. Adore him this morning. Glorify him this morning. Worship him this morning. Worship him this morning. Thank you for the season of new things for all you did for us. We give you praise and give you glory. And here we are. Begin to thank him for September. Begin to thank him for September. He has brought us into his banquet hall. His banner over us is love. His banner over us is love. His banner over us this month is love. Let's tell him thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your grace. Thank you for your love. Thank you for empowerment. Thank you for protection. Thank you for preservation. Thank you for lifting. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Abba Father. Thank you for keeping us for these nine consecutive months. Eight months, and this is the ninth month. Thank you because you are a covenant keeping God. You are a covenant keeping God. God, you are a covenant keeping God. The one that keep a covenant with the day. The one that keep a covenant with the night. The one that keep a covenant with the month. The one that keep a covenant with the hours. The one that keep a covenant with the seconds. The one that keep a covenant with the year. The one that keep a covenant with the wind. The one that keep a covenant with the sun. The one that keep a covenant with his people. We just rise up to say thank you. 
We rise up this morning to say thank you. We rise up this morning to say thank you. We rise up this morning to say thank you. We rise up this morning to say thank you. We rise up this morning to say thank you. Excited God, we, exalted God, we thank you. Oh, Father, we thank you. You are the lily of the valley. You are the bright and the morning star. Yahweh is your name. We prostrate before you. We join the 20 and 4 elders that you are to declare that you are Lord. We join all the angelic hosts to declare that you are powerful. You are gracious, oh God. Lord, we give you praise. We worship you. Thank you, Abba Father. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Somebody that is excited to see the moon shout a big amen. Hallelujah. Make a joyful noise and tell him thank you, Jesus. Glory, glory, glory for the new moon. We thank you for the new moon. Lord, thank you for the new moon. Thank you for the new. We are excited to see the new moon. Ah, somebody that is excited, make a joyful noise and thank him anyhow. Praise him anyhow. Thank you, Jesus, for the new moon. Thank you, thank you. Thank him anyhow. Praise him anyhow. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory to the Lamb of God. Are you excited? I'm the happiest man on earth today. I am the happiest man on the pulpit today because God has made it possible for me to see this moon. Hallelujah. I'm excited. I am sound. I'm alive. I am healthy. I'm in the presence of my father. I'm in the presence of my father and anything can happen to me. I am in the presence of Jesus. Anything, every miracle is guaranteed. Hallelujah. I am in the presence of my the master. My miracle is guaranteed. My lifting is guaranteed. My the power of God is guaranteed. Direction is guaranteed. Answers all of the way coming. Hey, somebody shout a big hallelujah. Psalms 103. Or Psalms 110. Sorry. Hallelujah. Let's give direct, let's give this month direction. Listen. There's so much loaded for you this month. That's what God said. So much is loaded for you this month. So much is loaded for you this month. Why is September a strategic month? September is a, a strategic month because September is opening up a new month and it's opening up the last quarter of the year. Hallelujah. And God will always reserve the best for the last. That's why September is crucial. So, is a month of prayer is also the month of fasting there is the fasting of the ninth month and there's the prayer called the ninth season the the ninth hour prayer i will show you as we go along hallelujah glory be to god that's why you must position yourself mentally emotionally physically spiritually financially to tap into the reservoir of god's blessing for this month and i see great things happening this month also, I see great things happening this month. Are you there? Psalms 110, verse 1 to 3. The Lord said to my Lord, Sit down at, the, at, the right, at my right hand until I make thy enemies thy footstool. The Lord sent what the rod of his strength out of Zion. Rule in the midst of thy enemies. Hallelujah. That is our declaration this month. September, I rule in the midst of my enemies. September, I do what? I rule in the. Can I hear you prophesy this morning? September, September, I rule in the midst of all my enemies. I rule in the midst of my enemies. September, I rule in the midst of my enemies. September, I rule in the midst of my enemies. September, I rule in the midst of lack. September, I rule in the midst of sickness. September, I rule in the midst of hardship. September, I rule in the midst of attack. September, I rule in the midst of lack. September, I rule in the midst of darkness. September, I rule in my family. September, I rule in the office. September, I rule in my going out. September, I rule in my coming in. Is somebody prophesying this morning? You're already taking charge. You're already taking charge. You're already taking charge. You're already taking charge. I want to declare September, I rule in the midst of my enemy. Lord, that is my declaration. I receive your word this morning. 
I receive your word this morning. September, hear me. I stand at the gates of September. I declare that in the month of September, I rule in the midst of my enemies. September, I rule in the midst of my enemies. That's what the word of God said. He said, rule in the midst of your enemies. I rule in the midst of bad economy. I rule in the midst of sicknesses and diseases. I rule in the midst of death. I rule in the midst of witches and wizards. I rule in the midst of occultic forces. I rule in the midst of lack. I rule in the midst of sickness. September, hear ye the word of the Lord. I rule. I rule this month. Let every situation be liar. Let the word of God come through for you. Let every situation, let your health situation be liar. Let, the, let God come through for you. Let September, I rule in the midst of my enemies. September, I rule in the midst of my enemies. I rule in the midst of darkness. I, I, are you declaring this morning? He said, The Lord said to my Lord, Sit down at the right hand until I make your enemies your first. Not this month, all the enemies are my first. Sickness is my first. That is my first tier. Lack is my first tier. Hey, ya ka 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 ka. Satanic oppression and satanic attack. They they are all my first tier. Hey, like I said, the Lord will send forth His rod out of Zion, and He say, "Rule, I rule by the rod." What is the rod of God? The rod of God is the word of God. I rule by the word of God. He say, "Akalaba shakata ya." E kada da 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 shakata. I rule by the rod, and the rod say. Greater is he that is in me than he that is in the world. I rule by the word. The Bible said, Damn, there is therefore no condemnation to them that I cry Jesus, who walk not after the flesh, but they walk after the spirit. For the spirit of life that is in Christ Jesus, the spirit of life that is in Christ Jesus, has swallowed the spirit of law of death. A rab and sin. I rule by the rod. Is anybody ruling by the rod? I rule by the rod. He said, no weapon fashion me. That's what the rod said. We are ruling by the rod. He said, I, I rule in the midst of my enemies. If you, if you are going to rule in the midst of your enemies, you must take the rod. The rod must be in your mouth. The rod must be in your hand. The rod must be in your heart. I take the rod this morning. I rule by the rod. The rod is the word of God. He was the, he is the stem of Jesse. He was the stem of Jesse in the book of Isaiah chapter 11. He was the stem of Jesse. He is the written word. He is the, he was the living word. He is the resurrected word. I rule by the word. I rule September by the word. The Bible said let them associate themselves together. They shall be in pieces. Let them take counsel. It shall not stand. For the Lord is not with them. I rule by the rod. The rod says unto God that is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all that I think, above all that I ask, according to his power that worketh in me. There's power at work in me. There's a rod that is at work in me. There's an anointing that is at work in me. I rule by the rod. I, 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 is anybody that came to pray this morning? Is anybody that came to take over September? To take over the month, the last quarter of the year? To take over Mba month? To take over the last quarter, which we always call Mba month, that make up September, make up October, make up November, make up December? My business rules as I enter this September. My business rules over economic hardship by rule by the rod. The by the rod says in Psalm chapter number one, and anything he do it shall prosper. Anything he do it shall prosper. Anything he do it shall prosper. Command your money shall prosper. Kingdom just assembly shall prosper. What are you doing, child of God? Call that business by name. Hey, Rabata Laka Sakata. That's what the rod says. And he said, rule. Hey, he sent what this rod out of Zion. He said, rule in the midst of your enemies. Ay, 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 ay. We rule by the rod. 
we rule by the rod we don't rule by strength by strength shall no man be i rule by the rod the bible the rod says i shall not die i shall live to declare the works of the lord that's what the rod says in Suntalabaya. so that is shattered that is shattered that is shattered around me that is shattered in my family that is shattered in my body that is shattered in my mind that is shattered in my spirit hey can i rule by the rod we rule this month of september by the rod allah barata shataya the rod says in psalm 23 the lord is my shepherd i shall not want he makes me to lie down in green pastures he leads me beside the still waters he restores my soul he leads me in the of righteousness for his name's sake yea though i walk through the valley of the shadow of death i fear no evil but thou art with me thy rod and the staff they comfort me he a table before me in the presence of my enemies he anoints my head with oil my cup running to the surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life and i shall dwell in the house of the lord forever and ever that's what the rod says i rule i rule over lack i rule over lack the shepherd is gone ahead of me the shepherd has 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 gone ahead of me, the ahead of me. I, the staff of lack is broken i break the staff of lack with the rod of god he said, he said, he will anoint my head with oil. My cup will run over. I am carrying a running over anointing. I am carrying something on my hand, on my head that will cause my hand to run over. That will cause my hand to prosper. He remember you know the former things that's what the rod says uh, remember the things of the old for behold i do a new thing i do a new thing the rod said he's doing a new thing i believe lord i receive lord i believe lord am i yandalaba sandolo boskia a rabbal is it any is any commander in the house is any any commander in the house that is commanding things a shakat the month you don't command will not deliver to you the month you don't position a prakata will dispossess you the month you don't control we control you it's time to control the month it's time to charge the month it's time to direct the month september here i am i rule in your midst I don't care the challenges. I don't care the programming into you. I rule every satanic programming. I rule in the midst of that programming. I don't care the sicknesses and diseases that have been projected into the moon. I rule in the name of Jesus. It's not by power. It's not by might. It's by the spirit of the Lord. I stand up the anointing of god's spirit i stand upon the efficacy and the potency of the god of the word of god i rule in the name of jesus i rule in the name of jesus i rule in the name of jesus in the midst of my enemies i rule the rod i rule by the rod i rule by the rod i rule by the lord i rule by the rod i rule by the rod and the rod says and God bless man and the man God said be fruitful multiply replenish the earth subdue it and have dominion I rule by that rod I rule by that rod I am fruitful in the land I am fruitful this month I am blessed this month I am multiplying this month I am replenishing this month I am dominating this month I rule by the rod is anybody ruling along with me we are ruling by the rod this month we rule by the rod the rod is the word of god if you don't have the rod you will rot it takes the rod to rule we don't rule in the energy of the flesh it said that the weapons of our warfare they are not kind but they are mighty to god to the down of strongholds every stronghold in the month of september i put you down in the name of jesus i 
down every stronghold in the month of September. Every family stronghold, every business stronghold, every stronghold in my health, every stronghold in my mind, every stronghold in my family, every stronghold on my job, every stronghold. Yeah, yeah. I pull you down in the name of Jesus. I take the rod of God and I pull you down. And I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I wish somebody came to this morning. Is there anybody that came to pray? Is there anyone online that is taking hold of the rod? This is my mount. This is my mount. September, I rule in the midst of my enemies. I am Alakataya. I stand at the gates of September. I lift up my hands over September. I divide every barrier. I divide every limitation. I divide the Red Sea. I stretch my hands as an ocean divider. I stretch my hand as the ocean divider. I divide every Ayatalaya. Every Every barrier, every limitation, a sablatalaya, a roklolo sakada. I reprogram September. I reprogram September. A kalabaya. This in my my family. This ayagaloski. Ah, sambo loko to 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 to. We rule by the rod. We rule by the rod. A kalabasata. In the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, somebody can shout a victory, amen, if you're in the house this morning. Whether you're online or on site, shout a victory, amen. The Lord has given us his word. I want you to hold on to the word of God. September, I rule in the midst of my enemies. Psalms 110, verse number 3. In the, in the midst of challenges, you rule. In the name of Jesus. And what did he say? How are we going to rule? By the rod. So let the rod be where in your mouth, in your heart, in your mouth. You are declaring what the word of God says, not what they are reporting on social media, not what the electronic media is reporting, not what the print media is reporting, not what the Nigerian government is reporting, or UK government, or any of the nations. You are reporting what the rod said. If you don't hold the rod, you will rot. But if you hold the rod, you will be what what the rod can deliver. Somebody say amen. Let's begin to look at let's begin to look at a um, few things about this month of September. We have first of all, if you look at the Bible in First Corinthians chapter number twelve, yes, we have nine gifts of the Holy Spirit. We're talking about number nine, right? The month of nine. You're going to pray this month. I am so charged with fruitfulness. Nine what? Gift. Okay, let me take the nine fruits. Galatians first. Galatians chapter number five. There are how many? Nine fruits of the spirit. And in Genesis chapter one, the first thing God said, he said, God bless man. And God said, be fruitful. Lord, this month, I stand to declare my business is supercharged with fruitfulness. Anything I touch shall be fruitful. My business, you are calling that your business by name. You are declaring my business is supercharged charged with fruitfulness lord every day i will bear fruit i am bearing fruit in the morning i am bearing fruit in the afternoon i am bearing fruit in the night mentally i am so charged with fruitfulness my body is so charged with fruitfulness have you ever plugged phone have you ever plugged something look at me here have you put something that, that had to do with electric all of a sudden you come and touch that tool and you discover that it's very hot and I said, they say it's supercharged. That is how God is going to charge this month with fruitfulness. I didn't hear that. Amen. You touch something that is very hot or hot. You quickly remove your hand. Why? It's supercharged with heat. I see God supercharge your family with fruitfulness. That you are looking for, that baby you are looking for is coming this month. That job you are looking for, that contract you are looking for, that thing that dominated you of the last eight years. Last eight months, this month you are going to dominate it. Raise your right hand with me. We have us to pray this morning. Say, my heavenly father, this is my ninth month. I didn't hear you. This is my ninth month. I stand with as one that has authority over the month. I connect the authority of the world to my life. And I declare this month of September, I decree that my life, my business, my family, my it, my bank account, my spirit, my soul, my body, my mind, in the name of Jesus, you are supercharged with fruitfulness. I am so 
charge. I supercharge. Eleke to Balaha. Zakrat, my ministry supercharged with fruitfulness. Mention that business by name. A kala, your store is supercharged with goose, with customers. A shagalagadagada. My prayer life is supercharged. My word life is supercharged. The word of God is generating result. Ayaba lakataya, e sabalata, e lekete tete tete, e shakata lekete, e rabalakatiya, e sokoto lekete tete, e shikata tata tata, e lekete tete, a rabatalia, e sokra ikla iskure ekete eke lagadaya. Somebody cry out this morning. I am so charged. My womb is supercharged with fruitfulness. It's time for your womb to conceive baby. It's time for your womb to conceive baby. It's time for your womb to conceive baby. Ayaba lakata tata tata. My ministry so. Charged with signs and wonders, a kalakatata, fruit of men, fruit of materials, fruit of men, fruit of materials, fruit of finances, fruit of finances, a lake to tataja. My house is supercharged with overflow, overflow of food, overflow of material resources. My ayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayay
gift in me some of you can write you can sing you can do so many things that will generate result and cause you to impart your world but all of them are sitting dormant i'm on assignment to set it on fire this morning that gift will be set on fire but the one you acquired through training you have acquired through training yet it's not producing raise your right hand if you are with me say my heavenly father nobody had my voice i say my heavenly father my heavenly father i stand as one having authority i stand on the rod i stand on the power of the rod I begin to charge i begin to challenge every endowment every potential every ability on my inside lying back, that which i came into this world front my word with to take over my word that is lying asleep wake up not every sleeping giant in me this september let the sleeping giant in me wake up let the sleeping giant in me wake up every training every skill i have acquired through training and is lying at. it's not bringing money it's not blessing anybody it's not even bless, blessing me the carrier of the skill lord you are stead up to manifest you are stead up to manifest you are stead up no wonder the bible says in the book of romans chapter number eight in verse number 19 the endless expectation of the creature of god they are waiting for the manifestation of the sons of god lord brother Taleka sataya, e karaba talabaya, e brata laba sontaya, e keleto sataya. Every gift buried in me, every picture buried in me, every gift buried in me, every gift buried in my children, every gift buried in my husband, every gift buried in my wife, every gift buried in my children, every gift buried in my children that God has placed and they've acquired to use it and shake their world and this line matter is being useless, it's not producing. And you sent your son he said go and acquire this skill you sent your daughter go and acquire this skill but he has, he has acquired the skill and that is a gift but he's lying down at home he's still sleeping at home not doing anything hey, Sakata, stay it up stay it up there's a sleeping giant in somebody the holy ghost is waking up this morning every sleeping giant in me there's more to me than what people see there's more to me than what nigeria see there's more to me than what europe see there's more to me than what asia see there's more to me than what africa see every sleeping giant wake up wake up wake up wake up the mighty wake up the mighty you have slept enough the bible says a little sleep a little slumber a little folding of arm to sleep so Somebody come like an armed man, a rap that I break out, I break out of non performance, I break out of complaint, I break out of impossibility. Oh God, let the sleeping giant in me wake up this morning. You say, whatever thing he do it, my hand, the time to prosper has come. In the name of Jesus, please raise your right hand up, raise your right hand up wherever you are. Lord, every hand lifted before you, lifted before you, every gift, spiritual endowment, the physical training you have acquired, and none of them is producing. He set it on fire to manifest in the name of Jesus. I set it on fire to manifest in the name of Jesus. Every sleeping giant that is in you, every giant that is in your children, that is lying dormant, that is sleeping by the fire of the Holy Ghost, let every sleeping giant wake up. 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 Every wealth in you wake up. Every wisdom in you wake up. Every energy in you wake up. Every idea in you wake up. Every opportunity in you wake up. Every power in you wake up. Every anointing in you wake up. Every lifting in you wake up. Every exploit in you wake up. Somebody shout wake up. I say wake up. I didn't hear you say wake up. One more time wake up. And you will see result. 
I say you will see result. You will rule in the midst of your enemy. You will rule in the midst of your enemy. You will rule in that, that, that problem. I say you, you have won over that problem. You have won that court case. God just told me you have won that court case. I don't know who you are. There's a court case before you have won the court case. You have won the court case this morning. I don't know where you are. You're online on site. You have won the court case this morning. You have won the court case this morning. Somebody shout a better amen. Somebody shout a better amen. There's somebody, your eyes turning you. When you wake up on the bed, everywhere will be turning. I caused that strange affliction. I said, I caused that strange affliction. I didn't hear you. I caused that strange affliction. 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 Somebody. They beg you for surgery, but God said, as you get to the hospital this week, they say you don't need the surgery again. Allah, Rabata Leko Satabaya, Ah Rabata, Lord, I ray, I rule in the midst of my enemies. I rule in the midst of my enemies. Satan, hear me, I rule in the midst of your programs. I rule in the midst of bad economy. I rule in the midst of hardship. I rule in the midst of pain. I don't know the pain in your body. There's somebody you are beating. There's somebody you are beating. There's somebody you are beating. I charge that demon. I charge that demon out of your body. I I'm the bleeding to cease. Rule in the midst of the bleeding. Rule in the midst of the bleeding. Rule in the midst of the bleeding. Somebody are having a neck problem. You can't twist your neck. You can't turn your neck. I check that demon on your neck out this money. Command it out this money. I command it out this money. You are restored back. 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 Somebody, there's a growth. There's a growth. There's a growth on your body. It's growing every day. You don't have money to go for surgery. You say, God, heal me. God say, I have taken it away. I have taken that growth away. I have taken that growth away. Every cancer is shattered this morning. I cause the spirit of cancer. I cause the spirit of cancer. I cause the spirit of cancer. I cause every sugar in your system. In the name of Jesus. Oh, that amen didn't sound with agreement this morning. And somebody shout a better amen. And somebody shout a better amen. And you discover, under normal circumstance, a woman takes in, it will take nine months to deliver. Lord, this nine months, I take delivery of my expectation. Every power, every prince of Nigeria, every prince of Portacot, that's true, that is standing against my, the delivery of my testimony, I knock you off this morning. I knock you down this morning. So what kind of prayer is this? I'll take you back to the book of Daniel. The first day he cried to God, the, the result in heaven was that Daniel, your answer had been granted. But so stood me 20 and 1 days. He doesn't need to take 21 days. Daniel did not know. Lord, I will not do unnecessary warfare. I rise up with a rod. This is my mode of delivery. A, a, a woman will carry the child for nine months. And he will deliver. This is the ninth month. It's time to take delivery of your expectation. Did you hear your amen? He says it's time to take the delivery of your expectation. Every expectation that I've been withheld, that have been delayed, Lord, we knock off the spirit of delay. We knock off the spirit of delay. Wherever he has been chained in the realm of the spirit, we bring that chain this morning. Raise your right hand if you are with me. I don't know why you are even sitting down this morning. Is it that you slept too much? Are you not, are you not seeing the, hearing the sound of the trumpet in the month of September? Raise your right hand and say, my heavenly father, 
That voice is not in agreement. My heavenly father, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I stand on the authority of the rod. I say, this is my ninth month. This is my ninth month. I come to you as a pregnant woman. I come to you carrying my seed, carrying my seed. I say my hour has come to take delivery of my expectation, financial expectation, spiritual expectation, ministerial expectation, family expectation, business expectation. In the name of Jesus, every power, every power of delay, every power of delay, every power of delay, that which have delayed my expectation for the eighth month, this ninth month that is my ninth month of delivery I take yeah, 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 yeah. I take delivery of my job I take delivery of my money I take delivery of my contract I take delivery every prince of Taco City every prince of Nigeria every prince of Ghana every prince of Denmark every prince of Saudi Arabia every prince, every prince of the United States of America we stand to challenge you hey, Kalabaya, Zabala, Kataya, the prince of Pesha delayed Daniel for 21 days you can't delay me I am not waiting for 21 days this September
church to get ready for the rain. Listen to me. Flood is a destruction. Rain is a blessing. Anytime flood invades a place, it destroys. But when rain comes, it's what? A blessing. And he said, the people gathered in the ninth month for three days. And all of a sudden, what they gathered, all of a sudden, great rain began to come. You have started the month in the house of God. Get ready for great rain. Get ready for great rain. Get ready for great rain. And I said that rain is a blessing. Flood is a destruction. We are not talking about flood. We are talking about what? Rain. Great rain. Somebody say great rain. Raise your right hand and say, my heavenly father, I am set. I am set for great rain. The rain of blessing. The rain of abundance. The rain of overflow. The rain of strength. The rain of ideas. The rain of opportunities. The rain of truths. In the name of Jesus. Pray your rain. Pray your rain. Lord, I am ready for rain. Great rain upon my family. Great rain of good news. Great rain of healing. The rain of healing. The rain of power. The rain of revelation. The rain of exploit. They gathered in the ninth month. And when they gathered, what they saw was rain. Great rain. Great rain in your business. Business rain. Business people. Get ready. Get ready. What you have not done for the last eight, year, eight months. Get ready. The rain. The great rain is coming upon your business. Shabala kataya. E barataya, alagataya, e shablakataya, e karabata, je grete leke, e subalaha, alia angololo, e shabababababababaya. Great rain, great rain, great rain, great rain, great rain of my ministry, great rain, rain of souls, rain of signs, rain of wonders, rain of abundance, rain of financial battle, rain of opportunities. Of business customers, reign of clients, reign of contract, reign of ideas, reign of divine connection, reign of helpers, reign of keepers. God says, Send me somebody, emergency helper, emergency helper, emergency help, a rampage help, emergency help, a lago lolo lolo bushita, a shagel lele 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 bushia, a shaba, 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 lege de 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 de, a raba laga da 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 ya. Great rain, great rain, great rain. Rain, great rain. Our Lord, I receive rain of blessing. Rain of blessing. I am blessing the city. I am blessing my going out. My business is blessed. My business is blessed. My business is blessed. My business is blessed. We are taking over. We are taking over. We are touching the world. Great rain upon your business. Great rain upon your family. Great rain upon your job. Great rain upon your children. Great rain. Rain of ideas. Rain of intelligence. Rain of protection. Rain of preservation. There shall be no loss this month. There shall be no loss this month. There shall be no loss this month. Somebody shout a big amen. Let's pray for this nation this morning. Hallelujah. Quickly this morning. Can I hear you call Qatar? I didn't hear you Qatar. Reunion. Romania. Russia that we have been praying for. Rwanda. St. Helena. Nigeria. You pray for all of the over King of Glory, St. Helena, Rwanda. We pray for Russia, for Ukraine. Let the voice of war cease. Let the voice of destruction cease. Let peace of Christ arise. Let peace with Christ arise. Oh God, show your mercy over the nations of the earth. The nations of the earth have been bastardized by man's inhumanity against man, by man's wickedness. Lord, arise. Show us mercy, oh God. We cry for your help over the nation. The nations will bow before Christ. The nations will bow before Christ. The nation will bow to peace. In the name of Jesus. Lord, wave your hands and bless God. Ebarataya, Sambra tekete, elike tuba, shangrete elelezuya, araba isogo bregede, ale esuga alikati, zegrete klaluskia. Thank you, Holy Spirit. We give you praise. Thank you. In the name of Jesus. Something has happened this morning. Place your right hand on your forehead, everybody. Father, thank you for the new moon. As they go, let your hand rest upon this moon. Lord, he said we should take the rod. And with that rod, we should rule in the midst of our enemies. Lord, they are ruling over this moon. They are ruling over this quarter. They are ruling in power. They are ruling in grace. Lord, every siege of hell over in any family is broken this morning. Siege over businesses, siege over careers is shattered this morning. Holy Spirit of the Living God, I decree and declare 
let everyone's month be soup charged with fruitfulness soup charged with fruitfulness soup charged with good reports super charged with positive reports super charged with progress super charged with customers super charged with revival let your spiritual life be super charged with revival let your prayer life receive revelation and energy in the name of jesus in the name of Jesus, because we have run to the house of the Lord in the ninth month, experience great rain, rain of blessing, rain of favor, rain of help, rain of strength, rain of ideas. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. Cause his face to shine upon you. This is your month. Rule in the midst of your enemy. Rule in the midst of sickness. Rule in the midst of sickness. Rule in the midst of disease. Rule in the midst of sickness. You will not climb any hospital bed this month. I say you will not climb any hospital bed this month. You that you are on the hospital bed, receive the power of God and be healed in the name of Jesus. So shall it be. So shall it be. In the name of Jesus. Somebody say amen. What are you declaring? I rule in the midst of your enemy. You step into your business as you open the door. This business rules in the midst of enemy. You are not going down, you are going up. I supercharge my home with fruitfulness. I supercharge this environment with fruitfulness. Well, this is the first part of prayer. Well, I've not even touched the prayer, but I'm out of time. Because September also opened the gate of Umba Moon. When we come back on Monday, when we come back on Monday, please don't miscommand your morning next week. When you come back, we begin to declare. The gate of Umba Moon must open. Are you understand? The remaining four months, gate must open. Things must happen. Then, beginning from Monday, we are starting. We are starting what I call ninth month fast. We are free twelve midday. You can come and pray. The church will be open. Hallelujah! But Tuesday evening and Thursday evening, we we'll meet to pray. Everybody, be, look at look at Jeremiah before we go. Hallelujah! Jeremiah chapter number thirty-six, verse nine. 36 verse 9. Look at what he said before we go. Hallelujah. I said hallelujah. Look at what he said. He said, and it came to pass in the fifth year of Joachim, the son of Josiah, the king of Judah, in the ninth month that they proclaimed a fast before the Lord to all the people in Jerusalem and to all the people that came from the cities of Judah unto Jerusalem. Hallelujah. Did you hear that? The ninth month, what did they do? They gathered all the people and proclaimed fast. So, if you like, start today. Amen? Nine days. What do I call it? Nine days. Nine days. Beginning from now to Friday next week. We are fasting. Stay in the place of fast. Don't say, uh, because they did not say we should come to church. On Tuesday, Sunday will be in church. Tuesday will be in the, uh, in the evening. But throughout, beginning from Monday, church will be open in the day. 12, 12. I will be here. As many of us that can come around. 12 midday, we are praying. Are you understand? In the evening, we pray again. I will be here. Are you hearing what I'm saying? 12, we pray. 5, we pray. 12, we pray. 5, we pray. 12. Just one hour, one hour prayer. Are you hearing what I'm saying? 12. But normal command your morning. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. We still hold next week. But every day in next week, 12 midday, this place will be open. You enter. Uh, somebody, well, they, I didn't see people have not come. Kneel down on this altar. Lord, I've received your word for September. September must answer. And the gate of Umba month must open. We have, not gone, we, have, we, have, we have done introduction of the prayer. Monday we go deeper. Something must happen to you this month. I said something must happen to you this month. Are you ready for it? You will rule in the midst of that trouble. In the midst of that challenge, you'll be smiling. They said this person not being they go through this problem, but it's not looking like you because you are on top of the, the issue. Hallelujah. The Lord bless you. Welcome to your month. Let's give God our first fruit. God is our first seed for this month. We call it our first fruit offering, and we unlock. We unlock financial blessings for the month of September. Lord God Almighty, we rule in the midst of financial darkness in September. We rule in the midst of financial darkness in September. Thank you for abundance of supply. Thank you because harvest we meet harvest in our lives. In Jesus' precious name. Somebody shout a better amen. I am too connected to be frustrated. I'm too loaded to fail. I'm too inspired to give up. I'm too talented to suffer. 
I'm too sinful not to be fruitful. I'm too protected to be a victim. I'm too useful to be useless. I'm too great to be disgraced. I'm too honorable to be pitied. I'm too focused to be distracted. I'm too blessed to be cursed. I'm too loaded to fail. I'm too inspired to give up. I'm too surrounded to surrender. Too defended to be defeated. Too empowered to be subdued. Too positioned to be dispossessed. Too invested to be wasted. I'm too perfect to work in error. I'm too established to be oppressed. I'm a miracle, not a mystic. I'm an asset, not a liability. I'm a Jew and not a junk. I'm a treasure, not a trash. As I'm a treasure, not a trash, men are divinely motivated to favor me with their time, with their treasure, with their talent. My needs are met. My books are paid. My debts are canceled. I have more than enough. I'm simply a person of influence. I'm a person of affluence. I'm making global impact. As I'm making global impact, I am making global impact. September. No. September. I rule in the midst of my neighbor. I said in September, you say the other one. September, I rule in the midst of in the midst of my enemies. I rule in the midst of my enemies. My month of September. You are not getting that this morning. Let's go one more time. September. I say September. September. One more time. September. I rule in the midst of my enemies. I rule in the midst of my enemies. My month of September. I rule in the midst of my enemies. My rule in the midst of my enemies. As you have declared it, so shall you see it. As you have declared it, so shall it be. See you wonderfully. Sunday morning, we're going to be here to praise God. It's Susanna Sunday. We're going to be praising God. And we're going to be starting a wonderful teaching on turning your night to day. Come on. Learn, be online to learn what it takes to turn your night today. Night is covering families. Night is covering nations. But there is a key to turning the night today. Begin from this Sunday. And Monday, command your money continues. We must arrest the month of September. The Lord bless you. Have a wonderful time. Have a wonderful weekend. Enjoy yourself. Return with abundance of testimonies in Jesus' name. Share your testimonies online. All our friends online, we love you. We appreciate you for following every time. And we want to say sorry for not being, uh, uh, we have not come your way for a few days because of some technical challenges. But your family is blessed. Everyone online, rule in the midst of your enemies. God bless you. Have a nice time and see you on Monday. Command your morning.